Hello, and good afternoon, chat. It's afternoon. Today, I want to play this game. It's called Pseudo Regalia. Um, I played maybe five minutes of it just to make sure that all the options and stuff were working. But uh, it's it's like a it's a Metroidvania type game. So I want to I want to just hop into it. I guess see what it's all about, really. So we're starting this like little cage area. Ooh, it's kind of spooky and stuff. Oh. Her character's fucking cheeked up. I forgot about that. We'll give her pants. Just, uh, just for posterity's sake. Posteriority's sake. So we gotta jump. If I press X, this noise happens. The black bar button. Crouch. First person. What the fuck is this? You can first person this game? It's kind of hard, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of like it like this, though. That barely worked. I hope I'm not too late. So, did I come through the mirror? Okay. Oh. Sorry, I didn't mean to fall out of my cage. I hope the princess won't be upset with me. I'm sure she's not. But it's chill. So I, I saw this game on Twitter, I think, and it caught my eye because of the art style. I just thought that this shit looked super cool and chill. What's up here? So we got a cracked ass wall. We got a little red thing up there that looks... Is that my health thing? Maybe that's a health upgrade? It is a Metroidvania, so I would expect health upgrades. Controls are tight. I like the frame rate on the character. Is there a way to turn it off? Retro... Wait, let me... What the fuck? I, I saw an option. I'm not gonna. I don't want it off. I was just wondering. Oh, okay. And grab shit. I like that the shadow is still just a little black circle under her. It's so stylized. Sword? We get sword? Dream Breaker. Press X. Attack freely while moving to vanquish foes. Hitting enemies will build up magical power to use it. Hold the B button or F key to heal. Sword. Kind of? No. Oh, it's like the fucking thing that Talia from, uh... Is it Talia? From Soul Calibur 2 uses. One of those fucking things. I think it's Talia. Open. Open. There we go. Let's see. It's this fucking bulborb looking ass guy. Well, he's dead now, so. Alright, through the wall. Okay, we're back out here. We can use it to break walls, so let's break this one. Oh, game saved, okay. Chill. It's like glowing now. I guess it's like a checkpoint type beat. Um. Oh, hey dude. Okay. <laughs> that guy was funky. That was a funky dude. I liked him. Sucks that he had to meet his maker, or whatever. I like her little flips. The animations are so tight. Uh, guess we go up here. These swinging red 
things. They don't necessarily look like axes, but I, I imagine that's what they're supposed to be. Oh. I was like, this block looks different. I wonder if I can, wonder if I can drop it, and sure enough. I love playing games like I'm a bored five-year-old. A little ice cave. Looks like ice, at least, I don't know. Hmm. Well, she stands like a, like a monk. Another save point. Okay. This music is starting to get a little bit repetitive, but that's okay. Oh, there's a whole bunch of axes down there. I don't know. Mm, another sword? New sword. Give me a new sword. Slide. Press left trigger. Uh, Press left to trigger on the ground to slide, gain a boost of speed, and slide under tight gaps. Okay, so we can do this. That's fun. I imagine in the speed run, this is going to be extremely useful. How long you want to bet it is until someone starts speedrunning this shit? I didn't see any other ways forward, so I imagine we need to use it to go through here. Yup. Yup. New door, new door. This takes us here. That's a new area. Where does this take us? Another new area. It looks like we can't go up. Why do I throw my weapon? I don't want to throw my weapon. It's left bumper. It's kind of tight though. I, I really hope that I get an upgrade or something that lets me like throw it like a boomerang. That would go so crazy. Uh, let's see. I want... It's, okay, so it's a big ass fucking lock on this door here. Oh, what the fuck? You can, like, somersault like a Mario. Oh, there's a new new kid here. Your disguise is paper thin, but it'll fool most of them. Not like it matters. You're stuck here like the rest of us. No getting past strong eyes. Who's strong eyes? Oh, what the fuck? I can, I can just, like, somersault? Oh. Oh, that's that's chill as fuck. So hold on, if I do this and then jump twice, I I jump twice as high. Well, that's chill. I didn't know she was chill like that. All right, so what if I? Okay, maybe not. Can I grab these leaves? No. Can I grab this thing? Ooh. Okay. Maybe I can grab this now. We did it, chat. New checkpoint. This looks like a boss room. Alright. Jesus Christ. He's got a big ass sword. Ooh. He's pissed. Okay. My fucking sword! No! Sword! Or, not sword, but my thing that I use. Oh. I need that back. I need you to stop hitting me. I'm trying to heal. Give me a second. Bomb. 
I love that. She's like a bishop. It's like it's like we're praying to God every time we gotta heal. I love it that I can just slide under his fucking sword. This is a big goddamn deal. Ooh. Oh good, and now my sword's on the other fucking side of the room. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We lead him away. Give me. Dodge. Hit, 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 hit. Oh, I love it that he's like missing an arm and it's covered in like mummy robes. Yikes. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, grab. Heal. Nope. Nope, hold on. Heal. Bomb. Bomb. And we immediately get hit again, just like last time. Bong. Okay. I didn't know this guy was chill like this. Oh. oh. The combat in this game is really fun. It is kind of button mashy, but... Oh, he's gone. Okay. <laughs> it is kind of just like press X over and over and over, but... I think that's still kind of chill. Gained a small key. Disappears after use on a locked door. I guess. Uh, well, I mean, we know where a locked door is. It's in the room that led us here. So let's go use that bitch. How do I use it? Oh, I just hit the door. Oh, that's like the starting room. Okay. Yeah, we definitely don't want to fall down there. We beat the first area. Or this area. Castle Sansa. These guys look like they're going to come to life and attack me at some point. Oh, I like this song a lot more. This is a very Metroid-y, Zelda-y song. I like it. What the fuck is that shit? It looks like an instant death plane, so I'm not gonna test it. Oh, a new, new little guy. These crystals are pretty nice, right? They make me feel safe. I think I'm gonna lick it. I bet it's full of minerals. <laughs> I love the font. That's like an Undertale-ass thing that it did there. But it's full of minerals. This is a big library. Hey, you got a good little thing going on here, dude. <laughs> you got a good... You got a good thing going on in there. Well, so now we got some platforming and some combat. Okay. Alright, so we got these little Goomba guys again. Knocked me right into the death plane. My bad. That's my bad, G. Cool. I want more movement. Give me more... What is... Is this another power-up? Indignation. Higher power gives you increased combat capabilities. Upon reaching power level 2, the range of your attack is extended. At level 3, your damage is increased. This is reset upon spending on heal. Oh, I see. Okay, so... Okay, so it's the little white healing bar. Oh yeah, so my, my hits have a better AoE now. Okay, I fuck with that. That's a good power up. Looks like we got a few ways we could go. I guess we just go right first. Just try this. These guys are pushovers. There's a key up there, but it doesn't look like I can jump that high. Is that a fucking... That's a tuba. What the hell? Oh, oh shit. This guy's a tuba. And he, and he fucking honked whenever I killed his ass. That's an electric turret. Okay. Alright, I'll get out of your way. Sorry, brother. My bad. I didn't know you were... I didn't know you were electrified like that. We can knock these down. I didn't... I probably shouldn't have done it immediately. But it's my fault, I guess. 
So now we have a shortcut back through. Okay. Hmm. This room looks sus as fuck. What's up in here? Okay. Some stairs, some guys, and a door. Is this a new area? Do I have a map? Do I have a fucking map or anything? I don't have a map. I, I feel like I shouldn't be here yet. I feel like I should still be in Castle Sansa. Oh, there's another big open empty thing. The Sansa Keep. Yeah, I still feel like there's more to do in here. Yeah, there's a health upgrade there. Yeah, it'd be really cool to have, like, uh... I'd love that the, the tuba guys keep honking at me. I really wish I had, like, a map or something. What the fuck is this big-ass empty room? Okay, good sound effect, good sound effect. There's a lever. Changes that. I, supposedly so I can get back up. If I don't want to get back up. This is fine for now. What's up here? This one was permanent. Okay. That's different. Mm, I'll just switch here. Probably to bring this back down. Yeah. Looks like this is the. Yeah, this is the room where we came in from over there. We got the power up there and then went in that way. So it looks like we've gone in like a, a quarter circle around this area. There's gotta be more shit back here. It's a big bookshelf. Oh, there's a broken wall. I knew it. wall. Weird room. Floating stuff. Weird room. Okay, and this is the listless library. Okay. I like this song too. I like all these songs better than the the first area. So that's good to hear. Is there even anything to do in here? Hmm. I don't know, man. If I walked into a huge library that was also in a barn, I would be kind of skewed out. But they're shut. What's back here? Oh, there's, there's a prompt over here. You read a book about how to deal with loss. Your mind is mended whole, driving you sane. Cool. Uh, I'm cured. <laughs> oh boy. I can't wait to tell all my friends that I'm not schizophrenic and weird anymore. Okay, there's another locked door. It looks like there's not really much we can do in here without some keys. Or a way to get on top of these shelves. But it doesn't look like I have any way to do that. It's like there's some stuff up there, but I don't know how I would about getting up there. 
Oh, another prompt. You read a book about reading. It's hard to read. Fair. Well, yeah, the, the dev definitely got their humor from Undertale. I love that. Ooh, we should play through Undertale on here. What do you guys think? Uh, how do we feel about under Undertale, chat? Alright, let's leave this area. It's not much here for me. Back to Castle Sansa. Anything else up here for me? There's a pole. And a door. Just barely made that. Hmm. Not what I meant to do, but okay. I meant to slide, but I hit left bumper. Okay. Um. Oh, fuck. I don't know if I can even make that jump, so we'll go left for now. Oh, no, there's no way for me to get up there. Maybe I have to make this jump. Oops, I can't make that jump. Okay. I guess this way's a bust, so maybe we need to go left out of that statue room. So we went right, and this is up, or forward, I guess. The fuck are you, freak? Okay. Oh, oh fuck, okay. Yeah, so we're, we're back here now. We're back here, so let's try going left. See if that leads me anywhere. Is that a floating sword? It is. How'd they get away with putting Hone Edge in this fucking game? And then the tuba guy. I love the tuba guy. He's so funny. Okay. This is definitely one of the areas that we haven't been. There's a there's an invisible ghost maid girl. Oh fuck, they knocked me on my ass, bro. Christ. Bong. Yeah, I needed that. Oh, I can hit the two guys' nose back. Can I not? Okay. I was like, can I not kill her? But I could. It just took a minute. Alright. There's no way I can make it to any of those poles. What do these bubbles do? They have to have some kind of mechanic, right? Whoa. Am I being hurt? That was weird. What? Oh, that's so fucking tight. What do you have to say, idiot? Princess used to love having afternoon tea here, but the Hayden man has run out of her special ingredient. I guess the princess doesn't really want anybody else's tea. Man. Sucks for the princess, though. More tea for me, then. Okay, so there's this. Which I'm assuming I can use to go over here. Not quite. Okay. Maybe to the next bubble. And then over here. Oh, what a sick fucking movement. A sh movement, if you will. New area. I haven't been here yet. Okay, good. Another one of those guys. I love that guy. Oh, I can, I can fucking knock his stuff back at him. Does it kill him? No, it just protects me. Okay. Yeah, I love having to deal with this guy while, while also trying to do... Shit. Okay, let me on this pole. Okay, I'm 
safe here for a second. Can I even kill the totem guys? Or the uh, conduits? Can I even kill this guy? Man. Broke his fingers. And I brought that cage up so now we can go there. Awesome. You know, guys, I had this dream last night, and it wasn't a particularly interesting dream, but it was definitely one of those dreams where I woke up and I was like, well, what was that about? I was on, I was on a plane. Oh, now the thing's up a little bit more. I was on a plane, and we crash-landed in the middle of Illinois, but it's like in the middle of fucking nowhere. And so it's me and like 80 other people, and we, we kind of all get funneled into this gas station because now there's a huge storm outside. Okay, so this takes us up to the keep anyway. Let's go check that other room first. So there's a storm outside, and, and we're all trying to, like, stay, like, dry. Because it's, like, raining really hard. And we're all, like, stuck inside of this, uh, this Illinois gas station together. And, like, I, I, one of the people was, like their clothes got all torn up so we had to go like venture out for clothes i've been watching a lot of the walking dead recently so i think that might have something to do with this but it's like dangerous outside because there's a storm even though it's just a storm and it's not really dangerous can't do anything here let's see it was it was definitely one of the dreams i've ever had it was crazy I feel like I've been in this room, but I'm not sure. Just to be safe with this thing. I haven't been here yet. Oh, I have been here. This is the bubble room, just a different part of it. Um. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Damn, what a, what a stupid thing that happened to me because of my own actions. Oh, and this is this room. Okay, so we have been here, kind of. Pretty cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, I guess let's go into the keep a little bit. Let's go into Samsa Keep and see what we can see there, I suppose. We might as well. Nothing better to do. No, not here. We want to make it... Damn. I tried. Let's see. More than anything, I love the style and the movement in this game. It's really fun just to move around. The combat's tight, too. Is this guy an enemy? No, he's not. C-Y-U-I-Y-C-E. Alright, sure. I'm... Is it just Mason? M-A-9-C-E-N? Hi, welcome to chat. How you doing, buddy? Let's check some of this stuff out. We got a safe crystal. Nine. You got it. How you doing, Nine? I think that these wall IVs are going to be very important later. I've seen a lot of them. And there's a cracked wall up there. We can open that with our thing, but we can't get up there. Good. I'm doing fine. I'm playing this cool-ass Metroidvania game. Uh, it just came out yesterday, and it's really interesting so far. Let's see. Okay. Uh, let's go right first. I, I keep trying to slide to be stylish and, and fast, but it's just fucking me over more than anything, honestly. So let's stop doing that, huh, Koi? Let's stop doing that. Oh. Okay. Cool room. Is that a key? Oh, 
assume so. That's a new function. Let's see if I can make that. I can't. Death plane. <laughs> we go back to being being dead again. All right. Locked. I I still can't believe that there is no map. They kind of just have you like fucking run it. They're just like, yeah, here, have fun. I love it. it. It feels so. It feels so much like an old school game. Like a part of my brain is like, if I really wanted to, I could like go and make my own map and like just figure it out. Uh, I don't know what's down there. This is a new area. So what's in here? Oh, this is where we went into the keep the first time before we actually started it. Okay. So we'll go back in here. I think this is where we... I can kind of go forward a little bit. Or maybe backward? Can't jump that high, so no. It's a death plane, can't jump that far. Cool, can't do anything in this room. Let's see. And then that room is just completely barred off. So we go next. We go next area then. No map. No go here function. So we went right here first. So now we go left. Let's see. All right, we got a death plane. That's fine. New room. Lock. Is this a pole? Assuming that eventually that gate's gonna come down, so maybe a maybe a shortcut of some kind. Oh boy! One of these guys. I love that the sword attacks you by flicking itself at you. That's hilarious. guys are so annoying. Some stairs. We're in. What about over here? Oh good. This guy. Oh fuck. Ah! Okay. My depth perception. I'm up fully. Oh, I love that. What a cute little room. And I get to fuck this guy up for being a bastard. Bong. Bong. Okay. Our healing animation is tight. I like the I like the gong noise. And we get one key. Okay. Well I'm trying to think of all the fucking Key doors we found. I think the closest one is just right back here in this like hallway area that we were in that led back to that first part off to the right. So let's go do that.
Nine, I, I saw that you uh followed like this morning. I haven't streamed in you know two days or so. How did you uh how'd you find me if you don't mind me asking? I wanna know like you know where you saw the Koi Jesus like stuff. Oh, oh, okay. A life power up. I would love to have that if I can reach it, but I can't, so Smeep schmop. Let's see. Oh, now we're back in here. We can lower this gate. Tight. Tight. Okay. Yeah, this wall ivy. Oh! I imagine this is that door. Whoa, 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 holy shit. No. I told you, I told you these guys were going to come to life. I told you they were going to try and attack me. Bastards. I knew from the start. Okay, well, it looks like I don't have any way out of here other than through here. It looks like there's a power up in here. And it's gonna have something to do with this ivy. Sunsetter. Press left trigger while in the air to plunge downward. Is this to break through? Fragile floors or simply stop yourself in the air. Jumping right after the plunge will result in a high jump. Okay, so it helps me get over walls and break through floors. Ah. Okay, so now we can get back up here. Tight. Oh, I fuck with it. Let's go. Okay. Gonna knock this one down too. Okay, and it takes us back out here. Alright. Now I imagine it wants us to go out and do some more exploring around now that we can jump higher. I wanna boss keys on this. Fuck Metroid Prime. I wanna boss keys on Pseudo Regalia. That's my favorite part of the game so far. It's just the tight fucking movement. I guess should have used it like a pogo stick too. Yeah, I wonder if there's any. I wonder if there's anywhere in this library area we can use it. There is a key door. I love this song. Oh, oh, ooh, there totally is. Oh, I fucking called it, guys. The song bangs. Can I slide through here? There's a thing, but it's encased in some kind of thing. Can I break it with this? Sun Greaves. Press A while in the air. After a short delay, do an air kick. Hitting walls and objects with it will cause you to jump away. 
can be done up to three times until reset. Oh, so it's like a, it's a wall jump. One, two, three. And I, that's all I can do. That's still really cool. Okay. These on now. Yeah, dude, our character is still thick as fuck. God damn. Oh, I think it's trying to tell me how to do it. Yeah, it is. Okay. Cool. Okay. Found me on my YouTube. Well, oh, I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad that those are actually doing something. <laughs> I have a video coming out tomorrow about, um, oh, I can sit down and rest. Cool. I have a video coming out tomorrow because I've uploaded a video every day for a month to see how the consistency would change growth pattern. And, uh, it, it worked well, I'll tell you that much. But I'm really excited, uh, for, like, the future of the things that I, that I do on the internet. God, that movement is so neat. It's gonna take me forever to get used to it, but... <sighs> Alright, let's see here. I forgot I have a fucking Starbucks drink. I've just gotten so mindlessly sucked into this game. I think I like these fucking big pants. Hmm. Okay. Oh, damn. Oh, weird. There we go. It's definitely an odd, like, momentum. They're little oh they're eggs oh they're little egg guys okay i thought that they were just little fuckers i thought they were like little goombas or something <laughs> oh a shortcut cool that was loud that's what it's kind of telling me by that checkpoint is like hey there's not much more you can do here unless I can somehow I mean, I can do that. It's just weird timing. Give me another. Give me another shot, coach. Put me in, coach. There we go. Third try is the charm. There we go. Ooh, you can do it. Let's go. What's through here? Ooh, a health. Press one to. Oh, okay. So the one that I just posted this morning. That's awesome. <laughs> well, thanks for the follow. Thanks for coming through and hanging out for a little bit. It's uh, the streams are definitely a little bit more chill than some of the clips I end up posting, but yeah, it's like it's part of the part of the comedy of it is trying to 
trying to find the good parts. The good parts do happen. I'm I'm very proud of some of the stuff that I've uh, some of the stuff that I've made in the last month. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm not familiar with other people's emotes. I need to get someone to make emotes for me. I have 200 followers <laughs> and no emotes. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I've just never had anyone to make emotes for me, I guess. My ex was an artist, but she, she wouldn't do my emotes. She didn't want to. I don't know. All right, well, we'll go back in there whenever the, maybe there's, actually, I think the entire thing was just for that. So maybe if we find another key, we'll go back in the library. But for now, we have this and we have our new sun greaves. So let's go see if we can find anything else to do. That's not what I meant to do. God damn it. My bad. Sungreaves also help because they, like, keep me airborne just a second longer. So now I can do things like get up here. I can't quite do that. talking about chat that's where we're going it's through here Ooh, we can we can wall kick off of that like tube I, I hope that we have enough momentum and kick power to get through we do. oh unless I fuck it up like that it's okay we try again we go next Hold on, I wonder if our big jump can just put us on top of it and nullify that. It can't, but it can get us really close, so it was worth a shot. that the kick kind of like stays out for a second for you to be able to kind of bounce at a weird angle and a weird timing kind of fuck with it I'm not gonna lie to you chat how do we feel about the goat girl are we <laughs> I've never seen it the game just came out yesterday it's uh I saw it on Twitter sorry I saw it on X. My bad. I saw it on X, which uh, doesn't sound like a porn website at all, I promise. Uh, and I thought that it looked pretty chill. Ooh, there's a key. There's a key. Let's go back to the library. We have a key now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go back to the key. All right, let's go back to the library. Definitely. But yeah, chat, how are we feeling about the goat girl in this game? Is she chill or or what? Yeah, I saw the game on on Twitter and I thought that the movement was pretty tight. I was like, oh boy, a Metroidvania game in, like, a Nintendo 64 style? That sounds hype as hell. And, uh, it was, like, five bucks, six bucks, so I picked it up today. And, uh, 
yeah, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty tight. I can tell you what, the speed runs for this game in, in about a month or so are going to go crazy. Just like any Metroidvania game. They're going to go so dumb insane. Yeah, it does look like an N64 game. I love it. What's this? Aspect of clear mind. Collect three to hold more magic power. Oh, okay, so better healing. Okay. Is that all that's back here? Did I use a key for that? I think I just used a key for this. Uh, no, there's a door over there, but I don't know how to get to it. I need another power-up. So something that lets me cross large gaps and I can come back here and go through that door. I don't know if that's chill or not, but okay. Keep going. I wonder if they could get this game running on a Nintendo 64. That would actually go kind of crazy. Fuck you guys. No, fuck you guys. Fucking horn guy. Yeah, there's a new area over here. I don't think that we explored this area, like, at all. So we might as well. Yeah, empty Bailey. I don't think we've been out here at all, so... We have a, we have a better jump and the sun greaves, so... We might as well start. Sword enemy looks so funny. It just kind of wiggles and wobbles everywhere. Oh good, an electric guy. I'm so glad that he's out here. There we go. Those guys are annoying. Hydrate. Hey, this is all I got. That's all I got right- Oh! Oh no! Fuck, I lied to you. My water bottle's full. I filled it before I went to get Starbucks. There we go. We're actually back. We are actually back. Um, this song goes crazy. I can't really get over there. Okay. Not much I can do there either. So maybe over here. It looks like there's a power up in there somewhere. I feel like that should be our next goal. Just trying to get into this structure. Yeah, this song goes so hard. What's all this junk? Another tuba guy. We got another conduit. Fuck him up. Jesus Christ! Oh, that scared the fuck out of me. Come on, man. We have to do this shit. Oh, good. And there's there's a floating sword, too. Now I have to go ding, ding, and then heal up. Piece of shit. Ah, oh, that, that fucking guy scared the hell out of me. Can I scale this? I think so. I got a major key. Okay. 
All right, cool. So we got a major key. Not sure what that does, but it's probably a good thing. Like, if I had to use context clues, it's probably a big deal. One would say maybe a major deal. Okay. I want to fight one of those guys. No, not you, pussy. Fuck off. Um... Yes. I don't think that's how you're supposed to do that, but that's how I did it, so... So it, it's real and it works and it's legal. Power up, power up, power up, power up. Jump while sliding completes the technique of the slide across the long distance with an airy long jump. That's a sick ass jump. Oh, yes, that's what I've been looking for. Yes. Oh, ho, ho. guys, that is what we have been looking for as far as movement goes in this game. Man, this move is probably going to be the sole way that people can speedrun this. The timing is crazy. But yeah. Okay, that's that's sick as fuck. I don't know where we go now that we have this, but oh there's somewhere I can slide through. It's so cool. Yeah, I love that. I love that move. A good idea. Okay, and a key. And this opened up now. Guys, we are getting somewhere, I think. Unless we really aren't and I'm just going crazy. But I think we are. a health thing. Oh, there's another one of those magic orbs up there. One of these guys is gonna come to life. How much you wanna bet? Fuck you. Whatever. The tower remains. Okay. Does it really? I want a I want a faster running ability. There's another major key up there. A tower holding the essence of the princess, never to be seen again. But with the three powers of the sun, one can find their own path. With the three powers of the sun. Solar Wind, Sunsetter, and Sun Greaves. I mean, those are all sun based. Unless it's just talking about Sunsetter and Sun Greaves. So I can't do that. anything I can do here or do I just need to wait a little bit and then come back I think I might just need to wait and come back honestly so like that's chill I get it metroidvania but I really like this area it's already got a pretty cool aesthetic Also, I can't get enough of this slide jump. It's so satisfying to do and look at. Let's see. It's a switch here. Shh. 
shortcut. Do you play random games or do you finesse this game? Uh, I'm a variety streamer. Um, so like for for the last month or so, I've almost exclusively been playing Pikmin because Pikmin 4 came out. Um, this is actually a first playthrough, so I actually don't know anything about this game. Um, but uh, I don't know. Maybe if uh, maybe if the speedrun want is there. I mean, it is a pretty it's a pretty niche indie game. I'm not I'm not sure how well I would do fitting into a niche. But uh, I do enjoy the game so far. It is it is tight. It is it is a tight controlled game. That soundtrack. It's another thing you'll learn about me real quick is my music taste is all over the place. So I just I love music. I love I love making or I love that people can make music that just sounds so cool. <laughs> you speedrun. I I don't I don't really speedrun. Uh, I've speedrun like Portal. I've done a Portal speedrun, but like that that's about it. I got my Portal speedrun time about like 28 minutes, 29 minutes. So nothing crazy. But uh, I feel like this is gonna be a good speed game with some of the movement and and other mechanics and stuff. But no, my my streams aren't normally speed runs. We need three to get the the full thing though. Okay. Is that all that's in here? It looks like it. Okay. Yeah, alright. This place is like creepy as hell. Reminds me of that part at the uh, reminds me of that part in the ancient cistern in Skyward Sword. And it's just like everything's a little bit like purple and weird. Why is there just a random ass platform there? Back out we go. Back into this song. Hmm. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if that was an area just for that. Push it on there. How do I open this? Okay, well, we have a long, long jump now. So I think we can go back and look for some stuff that requires the use of a really long jump. Hmm. 
It's like making her wave dash. Okay, I don't think there's... I think the, the place over in the library is too long of a long gap, but we can go check it out. We can still go double check, I suppose. That might be doable. Hold on, I might just need the angle better. Oh my god, I can't believe I pulled that shit off. And it's all for another another health. I'm cool with that. That's uh, pretty tight. The real question is how the fuck do I get back now? I sure hope I didn't just soft lock my fucking game. Hmm. How do I get back? That's how. That's how. Okay. Yeah, okay. Alright, 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 alright. We have to hit that pillar, and then we have to go and hit that, and then we have to hit that. There we go. Okay, I figured it out. It's all good. We figured it all out. Can't believe I figured it out, but we did. Cool. Oh man, this, this game's fun. Ooh, I wonder if there's anything up there that we can do now. Yeah, we did it. <laughs> we did it together. We figured it all out. Let's see. Um, yeah. Whoa. Oh, no, we already did this part. Yeah, I think we kind of cheesed it with the sun greaves. I don't think it really wanted us to do it this early, but I think I think that we did, so it's all good. Alright, back to let's see. Back to whatever this area is. Castle Sansa. I feel like we've been here for so long and I still feel like that I, I still feel like we're missing something here and I'm not sure what. But the um, the long jump is hopefully going to open up a few more paths. Come on. Yeah, there we go. What is my favorite game? My favorite game of all time is The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. If I had to pick a non-series game, so like a game that's just kind of on its own, um, Little Inferno is probably up there. I have an about me thing at the bottom of the page, like down on my panels, but I think that it's like pretty outdated, like, and that's coming from the guy that wrote it. Um, just in general, I think it's a little bit outdated. Yeah, we haven't really split this room much. What about you, Nine? What's your favorite game? This might end up up there, honestly. This is this is really fun so far. Um <laughs> Balloons Tower Defense. I know a lot of people who love balloons. It is... Alright, it's a pretty good tower defense. 
My tower defense of choice, personally, would probably be, uh, would probably be Plants vs. Zombies. The first one, obviously, not, not any of the other weirdo ones. In my brain, Plants vs. Zombies 1 is the only Plants vs. Zombies that exists, so we can just get that out of the way. here yet. Unless this is where we came from, but I don't think it is. It is not. This is a very vertically inclined room. Okay. Let's see. We're starting to get, we're starting to get enough uh, stuff to, like, have a good arsenal of, of movement skills, I say, and then I fall off because I'm stupid. Uh, but yeah, we're, we're starting to get to the point where, like, the game says, hey, move around, and we can. It's pretty tight. Alright, so now we got more of these bubbles. Ooh, not quite. Okay. Hmm. Hold on, I have an idea. So we bubble this way, kick the wall, and then go this way. There we go. Oh, so, oh okay. It's a pull. So it's a shortcut and also our way forward. There's another door over there, but we'll check that out in a minute. Favorite game genre? Um, I'm gonna split your question into two things. My favorite thing to play, like single player, and my favorite thing to play multiplayer. My favorite genre to play single player is like action adventure, kind of story driven games, Zelda, The Last of Us, God of War. Um, this kind of thing, you know, Metroidvanias. Um, so action-adventure type beat. Multiplayer, I've got to go with roguelikes. I could play Risk of Rain 2 all day, every day, as long as I have my buddy Max with me, and I'll be, I'll be happy. I genuinely believe that. What about you? And you can split it into the single-player, multiplayer question, too, if you so choose. So let me just like break down. Um, we can't really do much about it yet, but we can go over here. Not quite, okay. can <laughs> yay all right oh. don't need that bar there's a magic thing increase healing power by half an aspect of good graces okay so it's a different thing that i grabbed 
And I think that's the only thing in here. Hmm. that other door beyond the pipe there we go really hope this mechanic becomes useful at some point throwing my fucking soul two players fps one this rhythm game I mostly play Os. I I've I've played my fair share of Os. I'm not I'm not good at it by any means, but uh, I have played it a fair amount. I don't think we can do that yet. I think we need some more movement stuff, but keep this keep this door in mind. Alright, so we'll go back down. I played my fair share of Os. What's your favorite uh first person shooter? Like what's your go-to multiplayer shooter? Because for me, it's Siege. Rainbow Six Siege is like... I don't play it a lot anymore, but... Ooh, back in... Back in 2020 or so... I, uh... I was a fiend for some Siege. My ex hated me for how much I played Siege some days. everything that we can do here, so then we go back up into the keep. Just remember, we're looking for some more movement options. Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2 is a fucking goaded ass game, dude. Oh, Black Ops 3. Yeah, Black Ops 3 is too. Black Ops 2 is my Call of Duty of choice. Oh. Ah. I wish that we had a fucking map so I knew what was back here. Okay. We can go up. This takes us into the keep and it lets us open this door. Where does it take us? Oh, and it throws us here. What's this room? Hmm. Uh, yeah, I don't know where to go from here. definitely say that this is a Metroid moment, because I'm not too sure where to, okay, so this is where we got a key. We got a key in that room. Hmm. I like it that you keep your momentum for a little bit after doing that. Let's go back out here, maybe? Um, I wonder if we can cross this now.
probably. I bet, I bet we could. But I just need to look around a little bit closer. Yeah, like over there. Hmm. I'm sure we can make that. I want to try another time or two. Yeah, okay. This is gonna be rough, but... Kills all momentum to do that. I don't think we can do that yet. Unless maybe we go further without that for some reason. Oh. Nah. Alright. Well, Scoop smart. Oh well. Let's go through this way. Sun Greaves kind of fuck me up sometimes. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. There's nothing else we can do in the library. I think there's anything else we can do in the keep. But there might be something we can do in that like area that looks like a village. I should have to remember how to get there. Is it through here? It is through here, yeah. I think. I don't remember what's up here. Oh, that's right. There was just a collectible in here. The momentum feels great in this game. I wish the character just normally walked a little bit faster, but uh, I feel like the the jumping and then being able to do this kind of fucking outweighs that. That's what it was. We were up there and then we fell down here. I want to go back up there. Okay. Let's try to do that then. How do we get back up there? No, without the help of the trumpet guy, honestly. The last thing I want is help from the trumpet guy. Um, hmm. Um, hmm. Erm. Erm. I can reach these. Oh. So, oh, this is that vertical room that we, and there's the door at the top that we can't go through. I remember that part. Yeah, I want to get over there to that. Cute little movement that I just did. And there's a huge barred gate and a thing that we need the long jump to get over. This is what I'm saying, guys. We figured it out. Okay. 
Fuck. Oh, hey, what are you doing? I was supposed to go help in the theater, but I can't really get through here. I just don't really want to touch the bubbles. I don't have a problem. You go touch them then, bubble girl. <laughs> okay, I will. I'll fucking touch the bubbles since you're a little baby. Whoa. These are whack. They're totally good. Shortcut. Shortcut unlocked. Let's go. Um. Hmm. Um. Um, I don't really want to touch the bubbles, actually. Pussy. Tuba guy. You guys ever play platformers and then like press the A button hard to jump harder? Because I have that issue a lot. I'm sitting over here fucking pressing my A button like I'm trying to knock its lights out. Okay. This makes me feel more comfortable to do that. Oh, we were in that room. Yes. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Okay, okay, cool. New area. Guys, new area. It's new area time now. The Twilight Theater. Any of you guys want to come to live and beat the shit out of me? Any takers? Any takers? Any fucking weirdos? No? Okay. in my discord well welcome to the discord uh, nobody's really active in it i just kind of use it to ping when i'm live but yeah welcome maybe if enough people come from my shorts to my twitch and like what they see and join the discord maybe then we can have a semi-active discord in which case i'll have to like actually do things like hire mods doesn't doesn't seem fun but it seems necessary definitely seems necessary Yes, I can. Let's go. I can get over that grate now. If I really wanted to. I can go try to get that, but I don't think there's any way for me to get that. That is just too far. What did I say? Press jump during your knockback state to regain balance. What did I say? I said that there's just not anything that I can't do because I am just that cool. First try, by the way. The movement in this game is so fucking good. This game was six dollars. Uh, okay, I guess we'll go through here. Nose itches. Ugh. One thing I hate about this fucking septum ring is it's hard to itch my nose. I'm so rough whenever I itch my nose. Oh, okay, so this is a puzzle. Or maybe I'm just actually not ready. 
yeah, this might be a, a comeback whenever you're actually ready. Yeah, I, I don't think there's any way for me to do that. Okay. Keep in mind the bubble hallway. So we got the bubble hallway and we got the gunk hallway. How do I get out of this cage? Hmm. Alright, so cage escape. Bailey. Okay. So we're like over here now. Okay, so we're we're where we got the uh, slide jump. Trumpet guy, he keeps making noises at me, bro. I want someone to bury me in like a, a fucking a cardboard box. I've been I've been thinking about this a lot, guys. I don't because I mean you're all invited to my funeral. You already know this. Um, but it's like no, nah, if I if I perish, I don't want to be buried in some like big weird casket. I want to be buried in like a Pokemon trading card box or something. I got Magic the Gathering booster box. You know, we, we never went up here because I got the uh, I got the jump thing and then I just kind of left. But you, I mean, you need it for up here, so it makes sense That's why we were never up here. I should have healed and then done that. I'm stupid. I don't know if I can make any kind of progress here. Yeah. Seems like that's about as far as that goes. Require all five to open the great door. Huh. And there's very obviously more upgrades. I'm just not looking in the right places, I think.
I wonder if there was something that I was missing at that, like, big bridge area that we're right next to. Is that the great door? I imagine so. There's a, a, a heart piece up there. Can I get to it? I guess the answer is yes. Right. Cool. Now. Oh, that's too too slippery for me to land on, I suppose. That sucks. It's a big ass bell. I really want to get up here. This is what I want to do. It's what I want to do. I don't think there's anything left for us in the Bailey that we can get to quite yet. So maybe we go back into the castle or no, this is a major key area where we got it. is this? I guess I don't know. Yeah. I guess I'll grab the save and uh... Oh shit, it's 2.45. Um... Alright, I have something I have to go do at 3. I totally lost track of time. Uh, so, I'm going to head out, guys. 9, thanks for stopping by. Uh, I'll probably be streaming this more tomorrow. I'm having a lot of fun with it. Yeah, I have something I need to go do in like 15 minutes, 14 minutes, and I totally lost track of time. So, thanks. Thanks for coming by. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.